Hey YouTube, it's Navy98. I thought I'd make a quick video for you today on what it takes to uh, take a Gewehr 8805 barreled receiver uh, like you see here and convert that into an actual working Gewehr 8805. Uh, I know several retailers have been selling these barreled receivers recently. Um, I got three from Century Arms. These were $40 a piece uh, because I have a CNR license uh, on file with them. They're a little bit cheaper. Uh, I know other vendors are selling them for a bit more. But I saw some questions recently about you know what, what it would take and is it really worth buying one of these barreled receivers and converting it and buying all the parts to make a Gewehr 8805. So let's just take a quick look at the Gewehr 8805. Um, this rifle actually got right before Christmas at auction for $220. So remember that number as we're going through uh, what it's going to take for these barreled receivers. $220 for a complete uh, working order good bore Gewehr 8805 with all the parts and accessories. Uh, there's really nothing missing on here. The only issue that it has, it's got a bubbled uh, turn down bolt handle. Um, but other than that, it's in great shape. The bore is in great shape. Again, that was $220 for a complete Gewehr 8805. Now let's take a look at the three barreled receivers that I got from Century. And the, these may be different from the condition that you're going to get from other retailers. So as you notice, two of these actually come with most of the stock intact, which is a bonus because unlike the bottom one here, which is just the metal, um, you have the barrel band um, springs uh, on, the, on the stock here. You have the stock bolt, you have the recoil lug, you have the trigger guard assembly. Um, you have all those components that you may or may not have on your barreled receiver. Now this one does come with a complete trigger uh, and trigger guard assembly, which is also a bonus here. But taking a look at these, I mean, this bottom one, as far as uh, what it has on it, which mean, which uh, includes the complete sight and sight base, uh, is a really good uh, barreled receiver to have. Again, because you don't need to buy the sight base, you don't need to buy the trigger guard assembly, you don't need to buy the bolt stop assembly, and you don't need to buy um, the trigger group. So that's a good candidate for making a complete rifle. Now these, again, are a little bit of a bonus because you have the, some of the wood, you have the stock bolt, recoil lug, the barrel band springs, all that kind of stuff. Um, so my goal is eventually to convert all three of these into complete rifles, but some of them may require more work than others. Um, my thought is I'm actually going to try my hand at completing the rest of the stock that's broken rather than buy a, a brand new stock uh, to put on here. And I'll talk about that in a bit. So let's take a look at this. So what would you need uh, if you're just starting off with something like this? So this would require a stock and these other two would also require a stock if you didn't want to uh, try your hand at repairing this. So right now, the only place to get a brand new stock is a company uh, overseas called Fox, Mil uh, Fox Military. And they are currently $400 shipped to the US for just the stock. And that doesn't include any of the, uh, the hardware that you would need, like the stock bolt, recoil lug, um, barrel band uh, springs, that sort of thing. On eBay, on occasion, you'll see uh, original stocks come up. However, again, be prepared to pay at least $200 for a stock. And there's actually one listed on eBay right now. The, the auction hasn't even ended yet. It's for an original Gewehr 88 stock, which is an, actually in pretty bad condition. And right now the bidding's up to $355, which is insane in my opinion. So there's your big money, big ticket item when you're you know, putting one of these back together. First of all, trying to find the stock. Again, 200, possibly over $300, $400 if you go with the new stock option from Fox. The next part is, of course, these don't come with uh, complete bolts. So unless you already have a bolt that has a bolt head, which is also um, hard to find, you're looking at paying 
200 to $300 for a complete bolt. Now I bought the Hangyang rifles back when Centuries was selling them uh, for less than $100. And part of the reason I bought them was so I can get bolts for these. So you can reuse the Hanyang. They fit right into a Gewehr 88 through 8005. So bonus on that. But if you don't have that, you're going to have to go out and buy a bolt, uh, bolt assembly. And again, you're looking 200 to $300. Uh, that's the current going price on eBay. And when I talk about these prices, I'm either referring to uh, historical sold listings on eBay or Numrich if they have the parts. So then I went on Numrich and took a look at what you could find currently uh, as far as parts are concerned for these. And you can find the trigger group and that'll run you about $15 if you're missing that. If you need a complete trigger guard assembly, um, that's about $50. If you're looking at, if you need any of the bolt stop assembly components, it's about $20 for that. For a complete uh, working site, that's about $50. So let's see what else. Um, if you want to, you know, if you want this dust cover that's uh, on the 8805s, um, they didn't initially put these on the 8805s, but they put them on later in the war. So if you want that, if you can find it, and they're very rare to be uh, sold on eBay. I saw one sold a few months ago for 40 bucks, but that's just that, that uh, latch that fits over um, the trigger guard assembly. Rear slit sling swivel assembly, around $15. Butt plate, uh, about $15. Let's see what else here. Uh, if you want an original cleaning rod, which this one came with, an original cleaning rod is about $100. They do have repro ones for, for lesser. The front barrel band, if you can find it, they're very uh, hard to find. They don't, you don't see them come up too often. Uh, that's about $60. I could not find any records of the rear barrel band on eBay for sale recently, so unknown on that but maybe around $60 as well. Uh, haven't seen any of the barrel band springs for sale. Um, you could you know, use other rifles barrel band uh, springs and kind of cut them down and make, make those if you have the skill. So you know, probably low cost there, just reusing some other rifles components for that. If you don't already have the stock and you just have this, you're gonna need a um, the stock uh, bolt here and recoil lug. I have not seen those for sale anywhere online. Um, what else? Those, those are the main things. So you guys do the math. $220 for a complete working order, good shape, Gewehr 8805, or however much that is, all that is together for putting one of these back together. Um, so it really depends on what you're looking to do. If you just want to have get a Gewehr 88 for your collection, I would recommend just going with that. But if you're like me and like cool projects to work on uh, and have a lot of patience and waiting for parts to come for sale, um, you can obviously go to gun shows when people are able to go to gun shows again and hunt and peck for the parts that you'll need for this. But obviously it's not going to be the cheaper option of the two, but it is a really fun project. Uh, I'm not trying to discourage you from doing it. Uh, I just want to let you know what you're getting into if you go out and buy one of these uh, barreled receivers. Uh, oh, and also um, bayonet. So this is an airsatz bayonet that I bought for the 88. Um, over $100 for this bayonet, original bayonet. Um, if you want uh, a non-airsatz, like a, a more accurate um, original Gewehr 8805 or 88 bayonet is going to be a lot more. So just some food for thought. Uh, if you have any questions or comments or if you guys know of anywhere to procure any of these pieces of uh, hardware for these rifles or stocks or anything like that, or if you have any tips or tricks, um, you know, again, for like the front barrel band or the back, the rear barrel band, uh, if you know another rifle's barrel band that might fit on here and might, you might be able to make it work, please let me know. Uh, be glad to, to take all those comments, and I'm sure it will help everybody out um, who's trying to put these guys together. 
So until next time, this is Navy 98 saying go Navy.